Hi guys, Kathy here. How are you guys? Forgive me if I yawn. It is 5.15, 5.20, something like that in the morning. And my husband just left for work and decided to wake me up uh, so that I could be awake too. <laughs> anyway, so time for my weekly update. I am trying not to say um so much because I watched my last video and I said um a lot. It was kind of embarrassing actually. So, weekly update. Uh, last week I decided that I was far enough away from my surgery, which would put me at about, let's see what's today. Today is the first. Yes, today is the first of May. My surgery is June 20th, so that would put me about six or seven weeks away. Uh, so I decided that I was far enough away from my surgery that I would, whew, sorry, that I would uh, have a week where I ate the foods that I love that I would never eat again, or at least for a very long time. Uh, I decided to eat those foods. So, first uh, thing I ate was a patty melt. I ate half of it, made me sick, and some french fries. It sat in the pit of my stomach. It was horrible. Uh, it was ugh. Then I had, um, what did I have? I had Panda Express. Love Panda Express. However, also made me sick, made my stomach hurt. I also had birthday cake, my daughter's birthday, uh, which also made me sick. <laughs> and then I had pizza, which was Sunday night, I had pizza. I had two pieces and then I had five little buffalo wings. I was trying to behave. <sighs> And I had some um, kind of tortilla chips called Takis, and uh, they were very good. Those didn't make me sick. I think that I got sick because I was doing the Lean Green Diet. I think my stomach was getting used to having the shakes and then just the protein and just some vegetables. And I think when I ate all those things, um, I think it really kind of mess with my insides so I paid for it I, I felt like I had a knot in my stomach and I kind of regret eating all those foods so let's get into the weigh-in I did not weigh in yesterday at my doctor's office I was um, too embarrassed <laughs> not embarrassed but what's a good word for it I can't think I was feeling that I probably shouldn't go in and weigh in because my weight would have just been up. And I think uh, that would have been embarrassing considering I'm supposed to be losing weight. So, uh, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. So, I uh, did weigh myself at home. I don't know how far off my scale is from home to here. So my weight last week was 362. I weighed myself today and I weigh 364, but that's just here at home. Um, but it doesn't surprise me. Uh, yesterday I started up with my um, diet again. So I had two shakes and I had a chicken salad with some cheese in it, which I probably shouldn't have the cheese. Here I go again, sorry. And I'm going to be back on my diet. I'm going to have my shakes and I'm going to lose more weight and I'm going to be happy, but I don't regret uh, eating all those foods. 
I probably should, but I don't. I am glad I did it. I got it out of my system. And I'm far enough away from surgery where I don't think that I'm going to suffer too much. So, uh, for some reason I thought I only had six and a half weeks left before surgery, but I'm thinking that that's not right. Uh, if we've got all the month of May and that would be four weeks, I go again. Uh, then I would have until the 20th and that's almost a full three weeks. So I still have seven weeks before surgery. And all this time I thought I only had, you know, six or six and a half, six. And that was a couple weeks ago. So I guess my math is, was really off. Anyway, uh, I don't think I have too much more to add today. I got my hair down today. I know that's not important. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm just being silly. Okay. I'm going to go before I drag this out and make it really long. Uh, questions, comments, concerns. There you go down here. See? Down there. <laughs> uh, well, that's it. All right, guys. Talk to you later. Next week. Guarantee I'll be down at least two pounds. Bye.